we're going to be doing a general reading today. This is timeless, so don't get too hung up on when this is posted. So let's see. Okay, we have the High Priestess, Will of Fortune reversed, Knight of Swords, Knight of Wands. Okay, let's think here. How am I feeling? So what I'm getting right now is this this Wheel of Fortune reversed is really showing that the tides are changing. Um, the wheel is turning into a more favorable position. It feels, with the High Priestess here, um, a feeling of being stuck. And th this feeling that I'm getting is like, let's say that you are represented here by these two knights and you see how they have this active movement forward. Um, this one seems a little bit more hurried than this one in particular. Um, but uh, none, nonetheless, they are moving towards something, but then I feel something stopping this person, okay? And this person, and then of course when I split the deck, this is exactly what I'm seeing, um, which is they're, 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 your, your guides are representing these three swords as mental, physical, outside influences. And they're hi they highlighted this at first, which was mental, and then this is physical. So this it's the mental affecting the physical. The outside influences affecting your progression is not as detrimental to your progress as it keeps highlighting the physical, but it's it's it started from the mental. So they're pointing this out that. This is changing. That's what's changing is that you're no longer going to have this affect you in the way that it has recently with whatever it is that you're, you're trying to work towards because that's what I feel. It's like you had an idea set in motion and then this got in the way. The mental got in a way that affected the physical and now the physical is taking precedence over, so you could take this in terms of like anxiety or anxiety attacks or panic attacks or uh, just some something where your physical is actually being harmed in this process and somehow um, holding you, it's, it's not actually holding you back. You're not actually being refrained from that. And I think this is where it's changing in you, where you're realizing, okay, I'm going to just keep moving forward. I'm still going to do this irregardless of that. And it's being relieved. That's what I feel. It's actually being cleansed. It's being relieved. It's getting removed from your system. And I do want to point out where they're showing the external influences and how it's a minimal effect on what it is that you want to do. It has very little uh, to do with whether you succeed in this or not. Um, it's, it's really more the focus on your mental and physical um, because I do see that this is, this is meant to, let's see, hold on, let's keep going, eight of wands. Hermit. And the Ten of Pentacles. What this is telling me is th this is what's changing here and why it's changing. Hermit reversed is showing that as you were in Hermit in the hermit position, upright position. Um, this this feels like solitude. It feels like reflection, internal reflection. It feels like meeting your maker, like it's very close to your spiritual self and um, just spirituality in general. That's what I'm feeling. It's like you're very close to also, it feels like planning, like deciding why is it that I want the things that I want. And it's it's adjustments and moving very quickly. This is like, it's, it's this, 
the reason why it's moving so quick is because all it needed was a mental adjustment for everything to work itself back out. And the reason why this has occurred is the Ten of Pentacles. It's because the Pentacles are representative of the physical gain that you are earning, you're granted through your your achievements, but it also encourages you to notice that you can have that with the Nine of Pentacles. That last piece for the Ten of Pentacles is the spiritual aspect of it. So as you had been studied through your anxieties or through your fears or through some sort of obstacle that did hold you back in some way, it has helped you gain clarity on your vision in order for it to speed back up once you've made it's just like it's like that one missing piece once you've had that missing piece and now you're you're going to have the ten of pentacles rather than if you had skipped this then you would have the nine of pentacles you would have that fulfillment uh, kind of like earthly fulfillment in some way or your wishes being granted right but then not really having that full fulfillment of seeing the why behind why you wanted it right it's almost like it feels like an incomplete sentence it's like i want something well why do you actually want it and then it's kind of fully understanding the the, the reason why and as i look the top of the deck is the ten of swords the bottom of the deck is the ten of wands and i see you gaining victory over this it's that victory it over, here's the moon, it's the victory over the mind. And look at the bottom of the deck now, it's the ten. Ten, ten, ten. <laughs> All cups. It's the victory, it's, 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 and I, I see this also as like the extremity, right? It's like you, you can't give up at the very last. And this is a reminder, the ace of wands. It's a reminder of the start. The start to the finish before you you get to like that next level before it starts getting easy before you hit your stride all right and they kind of give me this visual of a runner and you know like the runner's high so it's like it can get very difficult and exhausting when you keep you when you start running but as you keep running then you hit your stride and it feels very easy and um, like euphoric so that's where I'm seeing it's like you're, you're entering that euphoric state and um, nothing's going to take you away is what I'm saying from what these pentacles represent. So that is, again, it's earned by you in a way where you, it, it's not, it's just not going to get taken away from you. There's, there's no way. And you gain that mastery over all aspects of it rather than just one particular part right because you have that spiritual aspect that i'm seeing here so that's what you guys what you your guides <laughs> wanted you to hear today um and so i will see you in the next video bye everyone